watching movies on my phone. So today's episode is gonna be a trip to a sneaker store in Miami. It's called Kicks Daily. I've been there before, but I've never really gone like an actual trip to it. And today's kind of just gonna be a preview of exactly what they have. If you guys want me to go back, make sure you guys smash the thumbs up button and let me know in the comments down below. Literally, I could probably film about three to four videos just at this store alone. And they are moving to a new, bigger location in the next month or two. Now they have a ton of Supreme. I could probably do a video on just the Supreme stuff as well as a video on just the shoes that they have. So if you guys want me to go back and film two videos there, make sure you again smash the thumbs up button. Make sure you guys are subscribed. Also, my website is launched. Make sure you guys check it out. Link down below, 25 items. If there's some bundle deals that you guys wanna do or if the pricing is a little bit too high, no worries, just send me an Instagram DM on DITR954 and I'll definitely help you out. Unfortunately, I did have a selling sessions with about $10,000 worth of vape but the seller did DM one of the round two workers and they declined. They said, sorry, we can't have you guys come in and make a video about it. I'm not really sure the reasoning on that. Um, so we'll have to see. I do have other footage that I can do a selling sessions on, but I've never heard them. I, I kind of wish that the kid never DM'd him because they've never told me no when I would go in there. So I don't know why he DM'd him, but it is what it is. I wish I could show you guys that. I still might do like a babe collection, $10,000 babe collection, but unfortunately I can't do a selling sessions with the babe stuff. So if you guys also want to see that, let me know in the comments down below. I'm trying to knock out a lot of content. I know I've been slacking, but don't worry. I'm just trying to get back in the swing of it. Once I get back in the swing of it, it's going to be like daily rotation, daily videos, like when I first started out. The numbers are still growing. We're still doing crazy numbers. We're about like 67,000 subscribers. We're gaining hundreds of subscribers a day. We're doing tens of thousands of views a day. I believe a few days ago, we did over 80,000 views on my channel, which you guys don't understand how crazy that is. Like. This is the reason why YouTubers get lazy and I'm trying not to get lazy because YouTube is like an investment. The 200 videos that I've been posting for the past two years are constantly making money. Meaning if I don't post a video for the rest of my entire life, I will still get a check every single month from YouTube. And that's why YouTubers get lazy is because they still make or they could potentially make more money with them out posting than versus when they are posting. It's so weird, the YouTube algorithm and everything. But again, I am gonna be posting. I have a selling sessions, I'm gonna be doing thrift stores, and I have a other bunch of content that I'm gonna be trying. I'm gonna be trying doing little skits, a little bit of pranks. Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode, and don't forget guys, let's get it. Oh, these are fucking cool. I'll just bring them in, but I don't Yeah, yeah, bro. Never know until you try them.
All supreme. Probably you know the price on these? Uh, no, it's okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah, exactly. Which you would think that they would have like a booty. Yeah, yeah. yeah they, that'd be kind of fire. Some of them do have like matching yeah. socks. That matches the shit they can never get. And then I could always come back and bring other yeah. stuff on consignment. Yeah, yeah, always do the, uh, So with that stuff, so that was just a of lot of stock. Yeah. Lot of stock. Let's well, go through these superps. The it's not like a fuck you attitude. Right? Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? It's yeah. like welcoming. It's not. And they tell you as it is. Yeah, like, I like the vibe. And I like how everything's in plastic here, so that way it keeps everything neat. Yeah, working? yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's all their guest shirts up there. Then it goes into like Palace, and yeah. they have a couple of Nike stuff. Yeah, that's the same one I found. I know that's what. I'm for. Yeah. What are they asking? How much? One time. Yeah, I sold mine for eighty. It's worth, right? I mean, yeah. We but see, like we we like found that at the thrift for eight bucks. It's yeah. crazy. No. I like how everything's color coordinated too. 
and like by like I don't know if it's by size, I think it's just by color. It might be by size. Then the jackets are all out of. Definitely has some good stuff. I wonder where they get these blasts from, like a Kia, right? Oh, uh, something. I'm sure they got a good, good deal on it. <laughs> I almost wanted to get from my closet. Oh, yeah. Wow, they're actually pretty heavy. I expect them to be a lot lighter. It's kind of crazy, right? Yeah. I haven't seen these in person. Just came out recently. Right? Yeah. The embroidery. Yeah. I just don't like Dragon Ball Z, so. Fake fan. 